Hello everybody, thank you for tuning in today. My name is Randy Calistrier, and this is the fourth concert in my Calistrier Corona concert series. This is a special concert of patriotic music for all of the veterans at the VA hospital in Lyons, New Jersey. Because of the coronavirus lockdown, uh, I'm not able to physically be at the VA hospital today, but I thought that I would record some of the favorite songs that I play for the vets so that they can still get a chance to hear them. I've been volunteering there for a few years now, uh, playing in different, at different units, and I have done several arrangements for cello, music for cello, specifically for the VA hospital. So I've put some of these together for a program for today. And we're going to start with the Armed Forces Medley. The Armed Forces Medley is the five official service songs of the United States Armed Forces. The Army, Marines, Navy, Air Force, and Coast Guard. And it is required that when you play these songs together, you must play them in that order. There's a pretty funny story about the Army service song. It's the Army Goes Rolling Along. And the Army was the only branch of the armed forces that did not have their own song. Everybody else had their song. The Army wanted one too. So in 1948, they had a contest to pick a song for the Army. And nobody liked any of the entries. So they gave up for 10 years. They tried again in 1958 and they asked composers to write new songs for the army. They got 800 entries for this contest. They chose a winner, and then people complained that the winning song sounded an awful lot like I've Got a Lovely Bunch of Coconuts, which is not an appropriate song for the army. So they threw it all out, and they started over a third time, and they said, forget it, let's just pick a march from John Philip Sousa. So they took his U.S. Field Artillery March, added some words to it, and that became the U.S. Army Service Song. So here is my medley of all five songs in the Armed Forces Medley.
favorite songs that the vets like me to play, I put into a medley here. This is Battle Hymn of the Republic, God Bless America, and This Land is Your Land. Battle Hymn of the Republic dates back to the Civil War. Uh, it's been around for a very long time. The song God Bless America was written during World War I by Irving Berlin, but it didn't really fit the show that he was putting on at that time, so he saved it and he brought it out again during World War II. And that became, Kate Smith uh, premiered that song and that became her signature song. She would sing it all the time. One person that did not like God Bless America was Woody Guthrie, the American folk singer. And he got really sick of hearing Kate Smith sing it all the time, so he wrote his own song, This Land is Your Land. And whenever he heard Kate Smith singing God Bless America, Woody Guthrie would start singing, This Land is Your Land. So here is a combination of those three tunes. <laughs> Thank you. 
annual National March of the United States is the Stars and Stripes Forever by John Philip Sousa. Uh, Sousa wrote this march on Christmas Day in 1896, and he wrote some lyrics to go along with it. He wrote uh, lots of words to go with the tune, but nobody sings those words. They all sing, be kind to your web-footed friends. And those words came almost 60 years after the song. They were written by Charles Green. And the reason everybody knows, be kind to your web-footed friends, is because Mitch Miller used to use that as the closing song on his TV show every night in the 1950s and 60s. So here is, here is Stars and Stripes Forever by John Philip Sousa. songs is God Bless the USA by the country singer Lee Greenwood. It's his signature song. It's very closely associated with the uh, Gulf War. It's very closely associated with 9-11. He actually wrote it in 1984 
as a response to the shooting down of Korean Airlines Flight 007. Uh, and if you're ever traveling up north, there's a Canadian version of this song. Instead of God Bless the USA, he changed the lyrics to be God Bless You Canada. God Bless the USA by Lee Greenwood. concert for today. A big shout out to all the vets at the VA hospital in Lyons. I'm sorry I couldn't be there with you today. Hopefully I'll be able to return someday soon and hopefully this, uh, this music video was able to bring a little bit of happiness and a little bit of sunlight into your life today. I'm going to end this concert as I end all of my concerts with America the Beautiful.
Thank you very much. Please stay healthy.